Welcome back everyone. Um, recently I bought this sensor, which is a vibration sensor. Um, but when I got it, I could not find anything on the internet how this thing actually works. The only thing here is the the internet address. It's uh, www.autoctrl.com. And if you go to that website, it's all in Chinese, so I could not figure out more about this sensor. Uh, it says here logo sensor var 1.5, but also doesn't reveal any results when I do a search on the internet. And here you can see uh, three pins one is for the ground, one is for D out, and one is for the plus. So I think because it was listed as Arduino module, um, this is basically 5 volts. So what I did, I just took the power from from the Arduino and then I connected it to to the sensor. So you say you can see here the red wire is connected to the plus. The yellow wire is connected to the ground. And the orange wire is hooked up here to this red wire. So the this cable, the black and red cable is connected to my multimeter so I can measure what kind of signal is being sent out here on the D out so if I connect this uh, sensor you can see there's already a one LED it's lit up if I shake it a bit you can see that it's it's, it's flickering a little bit so it's actually measuring something so I think it's, it's measuring the vibration so Let's turn on the multimeter. As you can see, it 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 it's uh, it's giving 0 0.03 volts, which is very uh, low. But if I shake the sensor, you can see that it goes up. So this is how the sensor works. If you shake it, you get a, a bigger voltage on this pin, on the middle pin, and you can just connect it to your Arduino and start using it. So I wrote a small Arduino program to show you what kind of measurements you will receive from the vibration sensor. So if you connect using the USB on the left side you will see what kind of measurements you will get back. If you look at the program I'm using pin 9 as the input from the vibration sensor. In the setup you can see that I'm setting the pin as an input and then it will start sending the data to my PC. Uh, the TP in its uh, function is only to uh, get the sensor readings from the vibration module. And this is how it looks like uh, when I connect uh, this sensor. You see, if I move the sensor, you can also see the serial connection on the Arduino. It's uh, it's flashing, and I'm still. You don't see anything. So basically this concludes that if you uh, shake it, you can also see the LED, it's, it's, it's uh, shaking. It means that the Arduino will measure something greater than zero. And you can use that to control any, any actuator if you want to, like an LED or something like that. This is a close-up photo of all the wiring. Um, what you can see is the red wire from the vibration sensor is uh, connected to the plus. The yellow wire is connected to the ground. And the middle wire, the orange wire, is connected to the white wire. And the white wire is connected to pin 9 of the Arduino board.